This is a quick movie just showing you how to uh, how to use the new extended depth of field tool with inside uh, Image Pro 7. It's actually live EDF. So we've always had the ability to try and get over these problems of depth by actually uh, grabbing an image at specific points of height using either manually, which is quite slow, or an automated uh, an automated focus drive, or an automated microscope with Z control. But what we can actually do now is use the live tiling plugin for Image Pro, which is under Acquire and Live EDF. And under Live EDF, um, I can select my method by which I want to stick the images together. So I have local contrast, um, which is pretty good for Brightfield work. And I can just say I want to do Live EDF. I can do other things as well. I can do dual views live. I can do a live preview on one image while I do the correction on the other. But we're just going to do Live EDF for now. And all I do now is I say Start. EDF, which is now my image. Now as I go down through my focus, you can see as I go along, I just add in what's in focus. I can even come back up through focus and try and add in more information. Yep, so you can see that's pretty neat. And when I'm ready, I can just say capture, and that's the file that I'm going to keep. Really nice, really, really straightforward. Now. A lot of people can't do this because they're using a stereo microscope, and stereo microscopes suffer from this uh, this drift, this green off drift. Well, we've actually built in that as well. We can actually create and get around an alignment drift while we're doing this. This is particularly useful um, for uh, generally for microscopy, but also in industrial imaging. Um, for more information, please contact uh, Tech Support or your local dealer or Image Pro Sales Office. Okay, thanks very much.